So I'm continuing on my never ending mission to find the best face covering or mask. Even this anti-fog mask. Anti-fog, it fogged right up. I think this thing needs some fog lock. That's not what we're looking at today though. We are looking at Mission's newest neck gaiter. This actually has what's called vapor active technology, which moist or wicks moisture away. I do want to show you the difference between the old Mission mask that I reviewed and the new one. Look at the size difference. It's about half the size. Pretty sweet. This is Jeff with Jeff Reviews for You. My channel is dedicated to reviewing mostly as seen on TV items. I look at some consumer gadgets, other household items. Once in a while, I do a little bit of a DIY just because I like to. If that interests you, I would love it if you would subscribe to my channel and click the bell below. That way you're notified every time I release a video just like this one. Oh yeah, one more thing. Don't forget to check down the description for my social media, Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter. I would love it if you would follow me there too. Now. Let's take a closer look at the new Mission Face Mask Gator. All right, so my first look at this new Gator or mask by Mission, I like the way it feels. It's comfortable, it's not too bulky. That was one of my biggest complaints about these older Gators or the older version. There's a lot of material right here around my neck. I feel as though I can breathe pretty much unobstructed and I like that. Plus, more importantly, I think that I can speak clearly and that will allow you to hear me. Sometimes with these other gators and such, the material gets wet, it gets stuck in your mouth and it's very frustrating. So far, I like this. I also like that it's staying up here on my nose, um, but also if you happen to have a smaller head than I do, it has a cinch strap that you can tighten it up and keep it around there. So far, I like it, pretty sweet gator. But first, before we go on, I want to introduce you to my channel sponsor that sponsored this video, The Coldest Water. Now, I've talked about them before when I referred to my water bottle back here behind me where I did a test between this water bottle and two of its competitors. I did it ice water to see what one kept it coldest longest, and I did hot coffee to see which one kept it warmest longest. Well, the coldest water bottle won both times. Now, if you're interested in buying one of these bottles, I will leave a link down in the description, but I'm also gonna have a second link where if you're like, hey, I like that bottle, I just don't wanna buy it, they give them away on a weekly basis and they have a raffle drawing and you can enter your information there. I did wanna say, they don't just do water bottles. I was looking through their website, I ended up buying this one for myself because I like these tumbler glasses. They have a wide variety of choices and as I mentioned before, you can personalize them. Now, let's get back to testing out Mission's newest gator. All right, so the fences are down here at Walmart, but we still have our required face covering sign. Let's try out our new Mission Gator. I'm trying out my new Mission mask and I can already tell you I like it. It's comfortable, it's breathable. Um, I definitely feel that around my nose it's tight. I like the moisture wicking part because it keeps me dry. That's important to me and absolutely I would give it a thumbs up. If I had my hand free, I would give it two thumbs up. So as I am continue testing it, so far I like it. Typically when I talk about these type of masks, I mentioned that they fall down around my nose. Well, this one has a cinch sack in the back where it helps it stay up. Also, if your head happens to be a little smaller, you can tighten it up and it's a lot more comfortable. So, tell me, what do you think of these gators? Are they something that you use? Do you like them? Do you not like them? What do you think? Let me know down in the comment section below. I would love to hear from you. I will say, as I'm using this, I've been tightening around my nose and it still feels really comfortable. More importantly, when I talk to people, I feel as though they can hear me. And like I said before, I don't get the material stuck in my mouth. So not that it's a claim of this new Mission Gator, but I wanted to test it out to see how it does fogging my glasses when I talk. I have this pulled pretty tight, so hopefully it's, it's getting pretty tight across my nose here. What I'm noticing though, is I'm noticing that most of my breath out starts to fog up my glasses. So that's something I wanted you to know. If you're gonna, see there it goes. If you're gonna end up using one of these type of gators, you need to get some sort of anti-fog, um, either a spray or a wipe, um, just so you know that. They do fog. I will say with these gators being smaller, they're easier to pull down and then right back up with the greatest of ease. Very versatile. 
So I will say one big advantage that I've noticed when I've been using this specific gator is um, I don't feel as though I'm breathing in the material. Now, I didn't really feel that from the original mission, but I've used some of these SA gators, and I feel as though over time when I'm breathing, I feel as though those fibers, like I'm breathing them into my throat, and that is uncomfortable. As I've been wearing this one, I don't feel that at all. I like that this is machine washable. You wash it on cold, you tumble dry low, and you can wash it as many times as you want, and it still does a great job. Now, typical mission gaiters, you can get them wet and snap them, and they feel really, really cool or cold. Now, I tried that with this one, and I snapped it and snapped and snapped it, and I think it felt cold, but definitely wasn't the drastic difference when I had these ones. I just wanted you to know that. In this video, we've been talking about Mission's newest neck gaiter mask. This one with vapor active technology that actually wicks moisture away from your body and I love that. Now, not that long ago, I did a review of the neck gaiter, the Mission neck gaiters, where you could wear it 12 different ways. Well, because this one is half the size, well, you can't really wear it 12 different ways. but. You can wear it as a bandana, right? And so what I like about this, you're out there hiking, you're in the woods, you're whatever, you're just sweating, you're working outside. You can actually wear it around your head and it absorbs the sweat and wicks it away from your body. I like that. I also like that you can wear it right here just around your neck, right? It, it continues to wick that moisture away. It has the UPF 50 sun protection. So for your neck, if you pull it up as your face mask or whatnot, you have that sun protection too. And I really, really like that. So what I'll do is I'll leave a link to the mission website down in the description. That's the only place you can buy these right now. And I will say they sent me this little card and at least until December 15th, 2020, if you enter the code, all caps, free shipping, you get free shipping on your order. That's pretty sweet. This is Jeff with Jeff Reviews for you. As always, thanks for stopping by and I hope you have a great day. What? Clorox wipes? Can you even believe it? I have found the mother load. How exciting. I really do appreciate that you stayed around for my entire review of the new Mission Face Mask Gator with Vapor Active Technology. You know, before we move on, I wanted to show you this. I was at Walmart the other day and I found a little tiny neck gator by Mission um, for little kids. And this one actually does have the snap cooling function. That is pretty sweet. If you're interested in one of these, I will leave a link down in the description. Now that's not the new kind with the Vapor Active Technology. That's more of the old style. Anyway, so you know what? Not that long ago, I did a review of a Mission cooling towel. And I know what you think. I am not sponsored by Mission. They don't actually know who I am. But I did a review of the Mission cooling towel and I actually used it as a face mask. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna link that video right up here and I would love it if you would click on it. And once you click on it by the magic of the internet, I'm gonna join you at that review. So go ahead, click it, it's safe, I promise.